That Italian twist comes from owner Louis Thompson, who's been in the bagel business since 1981. He offers Italian specialties, salads, deli meat, and plenty of cream cheese options to make a great bagel sandwich. I was also in the deli business, so I'm probably, I don't want to self-claim this, but I'm probably the first guy to bring 20 or 25 different salads, a full deli, and the bagels and bring it all together. And at Terrace Bagels in the Brooklyn neighborhood of Windsor Terrace, just outside Prospect Park, they come together like a perfect marriage. Now that you're getting married, I'm feeling all this pressure to have less meaningless sex and find the one. You know, a smart, gorgeous, rich guy who's amazing in bed. Oh, you've got to lower your standards. Right. Can he at least be amazing in bed? Oh, sure. Oh, I smell a project coming on. I could be your matchmaker. I like it. Mm -hmm. Can I call you Yenta? No. And you can't call the bagels at Terrace Bagels just big rolls with holes. Louie has the perfect technique to give his bagels the crunchy, chewy texture they deserve. I specifically made them a little bigger. They were four ounces years ago. These are about five ounces, five and a half. And we made the hole a little smaller so that you can make the sandwich on it and you can and you don't chew into it and break your teeth. But you still want to have that little bit of chewiness for that authenticity. He ensures that authenticity with his secret weapon, Boone. His roller of 17 years who rolls a whopping 35 bagels in two minutes. After Boone performs the magic touch, the bagels rest in the cooler for two days to develop a nice crust. Then they're boiled, sorted, seasoned, and baked at 500 degrees for 12 minutes. The result is a properly made bagel with a beautiful shine and a delicious bite. The secret is in the technique. And you can eat those bagels in the Terrace Bagels Cafe next door. Or if it's a nice day, sit at a bench in nearby Prospect Park and enjoy the wonder of a perfectly made bagel. Ooh, what about him? I think he's homeless. The other one. Oh, I guess he's kind of cute. But what's he doing? I don't know, maybe he's in the entertainment biz. That means he has no money. But he might be good in bed. Mm -hmm. uh -huh.